If you want to send a screenshot to your teacher, you can do it two different ways. The first way is it's going to send a screenshot of your entire screen. So what you would do is hit control and then this button up here right above the six. It's a little box with about two lines next to it. So I would hit control and then this button and it takes a screenshot of my whole screen. Now, whenever you select control and then the space above the six, this is what it does. So it just took a screenshot of my whole screen and it shows you a little preview at the bottom. If you want to click on it, it'll show you exactly where it is in your Google Drive. It just saves it to the whole part of your Google Drive. If I wanted to screenshot only part of my screen, which makes it a lot easier to see things, it's very similar. You would select Control, Shift, and then that little button above the six. So Control, Shift, and the button above the six. And that allows you to click and drag and select specifically what you want to screenshot. If you want to take a screenshot of only a portion, remember you hit control shift and then the button above the six. And as you see, my screen turns gray and it has this little plus sign with a circle in it. I can click and drag and screenshot only a part I want. Maybe I only want to show my teacher this part of my screen. So I'm going to click it and drag it and you can see whatever appears white. That's what it's going to screenshot. Once I'm happy, I let go of my click and it has screenshotted it right there. If I wanted to upload the screenshot to show my teacher in classroom, what I would do is open up the assignment and go right here to where it says your work. I'm gonna select plus, add or create. And I remember that it saved it to my Google Drive. So I'm gonna click Google Drive. If you just took your screenshot, it's a good time to upload it because it will be in your recent. So these are the last few things I opened. So you can see there was my whole screenshot and there was just a part of it. If you want, you can also go into my drive. And if you go to the very bottom, your screenshots are all going to be here. But if you have a drive that has a lot of stuff, it may be hard to find. So recent's the most easy as long as you just took it. So I'm going to click it and I'm gonna select insert. And as you can see, my screenshot is there. So if I turn it in, my teacher will get a copy of my screenshot.